السلام علیکم بردر اینڈ سسٹرس اینڈ فرینڈس آئی ہوپ ایوری ون از فائن وتھ دا بلیسنگ آف آل مائی ٹی اللہ سو ود آؤٹ اینی ڈیلے لیٹ اسٹارٹ ٹوڈیز ویڈیو اما عیسی ابن مریم فهو کلمۃ اللہ و روح منہ وٹ از محمد از سائنگ ان دا قران ہی سائنگ بٹ جیسس اور عیسی یسوس بٹ جیسس سن اف میری از دا ورڈ اف گاڈ اینڈ ا اسپریٹ اف گاڈ ناؤ آئی آسک محمد وئر ڈیڈ یو گیٹ دس فرام Look at what Muhammad is saying. Jesus, son of Mary, is the word of God. Okay, don't lose track of this. He is the word of God. John, six centuries prior to him, in the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. So what are you trying to say, Muhammad? Are you saying Jesus is God? That's what you're saying. You got it from the Gospel of John. Not from Allah, from the Gospel of John. Doctors are the night we do wash the land. So how can we decipher which of the two is right? Or who has copied from whom? The best test is the test of science. If we put these two scriptures, the test of science, we'll know the difference of chalk and cheese. When we read superficially, we come to know that the Bible and the Quran is the same. But if we do a research or we analyze it, we come to know that the difference of chalk and cheese. When we read the Bible, it's mentioned in the first book of the Bible. book of genesis chapter number 1 that almighty god he created the heaven and the earth in 6 yeah. days and these 6 days are 24 days mentioned in the bible the quran too speaks about the creation of the universe and says almighty god has created the heaven and the earth in 6 ayams ayam is plural of yom one of the meaning of yom is the 24 mm. hour day but the other arabic meaning of yom is a long period an epoch today scientists they say that our universe was created in billions of years so to say it was created in 6 24 days is wrong But the scientists have got no objection with the Quran when the Quran says the heavens and the earth were created in six ayams, that is, six long mm. periods, without defining them to be strict twenty four hours. Furthermore, mentioned in the Bible in the first book, book of Genesis, chapter number one, verse number three to five, that Almighty God, He created the day and the night on the first mm. day, and He created the light yeah, on the first yeah. day. It later says in Genesis chapter number one, verse fourteen to nineteen, the source of light, that is the stars and the sun, they were created on the fourth day. Imagine, the effect is created on the first day, and the cause of the effect on the fourth day. The sun was created, and the stars on the fourth day, and the light from the sun and the star was created on the first day. It's illogical. Hmm. How can the effect come before the source? Quran too speaks about the creation of the heavens and the earth, but does not give this unscientific sequence. Furthermore, mention. In the first book of the Bible, book of Genesis, chapter number one, verse from nine to thirteen, that the earth was created on the third day, and Genesis chapter number one, verse from fourteen to nineteen, that the sun and the moon was created on the fourth day. We know from science that the earth and the moon are the part of the parent body that is the sun. So to say that the earth was created before the parent body, the sun, is unscientific. The Quran too speaks about creation of the heavens. the sun the moon and the earth but it says it was yeah. created simultaneously imagine prophet muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam copied from the bible and he changed the sequence he says no both were created together bible further says in the book of genesis chapter number 1 verse from 9 to 13 that almighty god created the vegetables and the vegetations on the third day and genesis chapter number 1 verse 14 to 19 he created the sun on the fourth day scientifically it's not possible hmm. that the vegetation can survive without sunlight it's totally unscientific furthermore the bible says in genesis chapter number 1 verse number 16 that almighty god created two great lights the greater light the sun to rule the day and the lesser light the moon to rule the night so the bible says the light of the sun as well as the light of the moon is its own light The Bible says the light mm. of the moon has its own light, but the Quran says in Surah Furqan, chapter number twenty-five, verse number sixty-one, the light of the moon is not its own light; it's a reflected yeah. light. So imagine the Prophet copied from the Bible and he made corrections. Not the own light; it exactly. is a reflected light. It's not humanly possible. Only one who has this knowledge is Almighty God. There are several examples we can give a talk only mm. on this, and I'll debate. with Dr William Campbell on the topic the Quran and the Bible in the light of science and there i've mentioned many unscientific point mentioned in the bible time does not permit me to go into details the various unscientific mm-hmm. things mentioned in the bible which is not mentioned in the Quran for example according to the bible adam peace be upon him 
He came into existence about 5,800 years before. Science tells us that the human beings came into existence millions of years mm -hmm. before. The Quran too speaks about Adam and Salam, but does not give a date. The Bible says in Genesis, chapter number 6, 7, as well as 8, about Noah and the flood. And it says that the full world was submerged under water at the time of mm -hmm. Noah, that is approximately 21st, 22nd century BC. Quran too speaks about Noah and Salam, but it does not give it a date. It even speaks about the flood. But it says it was a localized flood, only it flooded the Ummah, the people of Noah Islam, not mm. the full world. Today, archaeological evidence shows us that the 11th dynasty of Egypt, as well as the 3rd dynasty of Babylon, they existed without interruption since the 21st, 22nd yeah. century BC. So archaeological evidence says that what is mentioned in the Bible is totally wrong. There are various examples, yes. we can give hundreds, time does not permit. So surely, this Quran has not been copied from mm. the Bible. Neither has been forged. As mentioned in the Quran in Surah Sajda, chapter number 32, verse number 1 and 2. It says that, do they say he forged it? Nay, it is a truth from the Lord. So that he may give admonition to the people to whom no warner has come in the past. So surely, we can undoubtedly say that neither Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon the author of the Quran, neither did he copy or plagiarize alert it from any other brother and sisters i hope you have watched today's video and i hope you like the answers of dr zakta knight because dr zakta knight always gave answers according to quran and hadith and i hope you have watched his video till end so in the first part of today's video we have watched a video of a christian parcher who was claiming that quran is copied from bible book it is a common allegation why Christians that the Quran is the copy of Bible. Prophet Muhammad wasallam plagiarized his book from the pages of Bible. It is true that Prophet Muhammad wasallam received the Quran after the Bible came into existence. And it is also true that the book of the Bible and the Quran cover much common ground, but the conclusion of the Christians criticized that prophet had studied the bible with a view to copying its verses in order to somehow fabricate the quran is absurd and untenable for the reasons so guys what do you think what this preset is true or false please let us know by giving your comments below and after that we have watched the video of dr zat the night in which Dr. Zatha Knight proved it that Quran is not copied from Bible. Dr. Zatha Knight gave the examples from Bible and Quran as well. So guys, what do you think about today's video? Please let us know by giving your comments below. And if you are satisfied with the answers of Dr. Zatha Knight, then it's our first to you guys. Please share this video with your friends and family members so they can get benefit from it and other requests. Please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon so whenever a new video will be published you will get its notification first. So see you guys in next video till then Allah Hafiz.